probably wondering why do I have a different shirt on today well my baby he had to take some medicine because he has a rash so I was giving him some Benadryl and um he freaking projectile vomited all over me and all over himself so I had to change my shirt so I went from the red shirt to this burgundy shirt, you know, um, and we was on our way to the doctor so they could look at the rash and tell us if it's just a reaction to um, the medicine they gave him for the ear infection or um, if he's got measles because, you know, babies die from measles. And it was just a reaction to that antibiotics all these medical people do is just experiment on us that's what they do man we're just fucking lab rats try this mm, try that mm, okay it's no secret it's fucked up in the game but the baby he got a big old rash from this fucking moxicillin or whatever the fuck she said when he's a grown up he'll probably be allergic to penicillin don't let him get no ceilings, guys. So that's what happened. Anyway, appreciate y'all for checking me out on my IG live earlier. Um, and uh, yeah, I mean, I just kind of went on here because I wanted people to know what's going on. And really understand, like, your life is what you make it. You know, DMX and Nas did a song back in the day. Life is what you make it so true it's what you make it you could sit here and be poor and stay in the same spot and keep being poor and keep doing the same shit or you could actually go make some shit happen get up get out and get something you know I didn't have nothing in 2009 I didn't have a damn thing when I left my ex-wife and um you know, I had a car repossessed under my name because of her. She got a car repossessed. You know, she uh, crashed this car um, that I had bought for her so she could finish college. Crashed the shit, you know, um, and um, it's fucked up, man. For seven years, my credit report was fucked because I was like, I am not paying for this fucking car that ended up where when she crashed the shit State Farm gave her the settlement of money and then her new boyfriend took it and bought drugs with it and then got locked up and then the cops wouldn't give him the money back because it was wrapped up in a drug investigation we was chasing this dude through South Philly and we kicked his ass at the fucking park fucking pussy and um that was a whole other story, but yeah, man, got a car repossessed under my name. This shit was charged off. I'm talking about like $19,000 car note. I never paid a fucking dime on that shit after, you know, my ex-wife fucked that off, basically, you know, fucked that off. So I had like $19,000. I just waited out my seven years. And that shit fell off my credit report. That got waited off my seven years. And what you do when you got a fucked credit report is you just get the money anyway and you give it to somebody else who's got good credit. So my current wife has good credit. So whenever I needed to buy something, I just give the money to my current wife and say, here you go, buy this for me. Gave her the money. That's how you fucking manage and how you fucking... um navigate fucked up credit life lessons